Uh, I just wanted to give you a quick tutorial if you weren't with us on class on how to use Canva and Unsplash, two things that will be super helpful for you for your final in this class. Um, so ultimately what I'm asking of you for the final is to create some kind of a graphic that will tell you the, that or that explains what you think is God's mission or God's purpose in the world. And um, so I will show you how to do that in a second here. Um, so you will, number one, create a graphic that has some words, has uh, a picture that goes with it, and then you will later on write a paper that goes with it. So like, for instance, uh, I have created a template or like a basic, uh, something that this, this would be something I would give full credit to. If you thought that basically God's mission in the world is for us to love one another, uh, that would be great. Uh, this this seems like maybe the only answer. Uh, there are a, a lot of answers that would be acceptable based on our conversation in the class. Um, so I'm not giving this as like, now this is the one that gives you an A, uh, but I am, I'm choosing a verse that I think you probably wouldn't use um, to try to keep everything else free for you to use as your actual project. Um, so here I chose love. Uh, and this is basically talking about how the greatest um, the greatest thing that remains, uh, we have faith, we have hope, but really we have love and that is what we're called to do. And so the greatest of these things is that we have love. This comes from 1 Corinthians 13, 13. Um, and so I could easily write my paper about this call to love. Sorry, you hear the dog limping around around here? No. Um, uh, so I have a background here as well. Um, that clearly has to do with love. And uh, I had selected one that I felt like I could talk about at some some length um, because you see initially the heart, but there's also the hands. Um, so you can talk about the number of people that are involved in this, the imagery that goes into it as well, um, that, that explains further the idea of love. Uh, so there's a lot in here that I could talk about uh, in terms of that, that final paper that you would need to write. Uh, but how did I create this? That's a great question. Let's go here to Canva. Um, and we're just going to create a basic one. Uh, we will say we're going to take a social media template because that sounds nifty. Um, if you have like a certain thing that you want, um, sale, we could look at all these sales. Uh, so there's all kinds of different templates. Um, we're gonna, we're gonna go with this. This looks, I'm feeling this today. Um, uh, not again, or maybe not again, I don't think I said this yet, but I'm going to create one right now that would clearly not be worth any credit. Uh, I, cause I'm going to say that hats give life. No, hats, no. Uh, I find I'll just say hats give life. <laughs> um, gloves <laughs> are dope. And this is going to come from second hesitations <laughs> for nine. Not a real Bible verse, you guys. Not a real Bible verse. Um, so if I was doing this and this was what I wanted to write, um, I just it's gonna buy, bother me. I feel like I need this to go here. Hats give life. Clearly, that's better. Um, now I need a graphic. This is where we have this beautiful place called Unsplash. Uh, I just love this background graphic they have right now. Um, but so Unsplash is basically a, a place for free, high quality, uh, graphics. So now that I'm here, I would just basically type in hats and see, oh, look, <laughs> so many hats. These hats give life clearly. Um, but I'm not just going to take the first one I see. I'm going to kind of look around a little bit, see if there's something that, that I can really work with the imagery on, um, I don't know, we they kind of seem to be going further away from what the goal is. 
So I might have to either go refine my search or use something that I had found earlier just for the sake of time. Uh, I'm just going to take this one or no, this one. I think I could talk about this one because look, uh, with this hat, uh, he is like clearly going on some kind of adventure. So I'm going to download it. Let's go back to Canva. Um, I think it was this one we were in. I need to, oh look, she's already wearing a hat. That's convenient, but just for the sake of showing you how, we're gonna switch here. So I'm gonna upload this image into here. Uh, perfect, it's uploading, doing its thing. Um, just double check here. Nope, I do need to go here. While it uploads. Um, so when it goes all the way across, I'm out at the farm, so I have slow internet today. So I apologize. Do, 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 do. Well, while I was doing that, I'll tell you also about the final paper. Uh, so the final paper, basically you're going to uh, tell me why you chose, what words you chose, and what image you chose. It's going to be 750 to 1,000 words, um, basically just explaining the imagery and the words that you put together about what God's mission is. Um, so you don't want to just like willy-nilly choose diddly squat. Uh, you want to choose something that actually has meaning. Look, we can drop it on here now. Oh, here we go. Oh, I liked what it was doing, whatever it was doing. Let's try that one more time. See if I can just replace. Yeah. Oh, man. Replace it. Yeah. Yeah. Replace it. That away. Oh, perfect. <laughs> cool. So um, now I have this guy with a hat, uh, and it says, Gloves are dope, hats give life. Uh, this probably wouldn't get you any credit, number one, because gloves are dope. What does it have to do with hats give life? Nothing. Um, and there are no gloves in this image. Hats give life? Sure. Um, Second Hesitations 4.9. That's not a real Bible verse, yo. <laughs> so no, it doesn't get you any any points. Uh, however, in terms of like what you would need to do, this would get you full credit in terms of the kind of the kind of uh, creation that you need to put into it. So if this was your final product, you would just click download, and it would download it from the internet, um, and you can upload it to Google Classroom. From there, you'll just write your paper. Uh, which I have further explanation on on Google Classroom. If you have any questions, uh, don't worry. If you can, you can shoot me a text message anytime over break or whenever. Um, and that number is on the syllabus or on the syllabus. It's on the um, description for this assignment. So, thank you guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye.